The year is 1919, and we're talking about one of the most viscous disasters in American history, the Boston Molasses Flood, or, as my tour guide called it in 2019, the Boston Molassacre. No, no, you cannot joke about that. Yeah, that's not funny, Arthur. That's not the kind of humor we do on this show. In 1919, a Boston distillery was operating an enormous molasses tank at the north end of the town. But they hadn't done much work to make sure that it was safe, so on January 15th, a large deposit of molasses caused the tank to rupture, sending a wave of molasses into Boston. <laughs> you know 21 people died, right? The flood reached 40 feet in height in places and traveled at speeds of up to 35 miles per hour. This wave crushed buildings, knocked over an elevated train line, and trapped pedestrians in goo. 150 people were injured, 21 died, most of the fatalities being people asphyxiating while trapped in the rapidly cooling molasses. A class action lawsuit found the company liable and forced them to pay damages, so can I at least say there was some just desserts? Boo, 